Hi Virgo, welcome to my main channel, Chelsea Love Tarot. This is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to find out who has been thinking about you today and why. Today is the 29th of September, 2024. Time here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia is 8.46 a.m. And Virgo, I'm giving away free personal reading for a lucky winner once a week. To enter, hit like, subscribe, and comment below. I love Virgo. It's free to subscribe. If you've commented before, you can do it again. It will increase your chance in winning, and winners will be announced on the community page weekly. Okay, Virgo, let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for Virgo. Who has been thinking about Virgo today and why? Whoa, the devil. Virgo, please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and this person. Five Pentacles in reverse at the bottom of the deck. This person could be a Capricorn, could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, um, Fire Sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I've already said that. So this person is obsessed, obsessed, obsessed with you, okay? You've got one person here, Virgo, whom I feel, because it's right next to Queen of Pentacles, it's you. So this person is obsessive over you thinking a lot about you, about commitment, um, especially, especially Virgo, there's somebody you've been kind of like ignoring, you've been focusing on your work, and this person could be thinking about how to get your attention, because the King of Swords is also somebody who plans, somebody who strategizes, so they could be thinking about, okay, how do I what should I do to get Virgo's attention? Because Queen of Wands here is in reverse. If you're embodying the Queen of Wands in reverse, that means you've been kind of like ignoring this person. Death here is in reverse. Either both of you are separated right now, or it could be going through, um, could be on its way to separation. Look at the Queen of Swords. I feel like all this, uh, all these queens here, they are you, okay? You're embodying all these three queens here. You may have cut them off. You may have told them off. Um, or you've been really cold towards them and the Queen of Wands, you haven't been particularly passionate towards them, not giving them that kind of um, attention that they may want. The type of attention that the devil wants is usually, it, it could be something sexual. I'm not sure if I can say that word, but um, I think you are sexually depriving depriving this person the chariot here, here is in reverse so you either put a stop to it or you just kind of pause pause uh, giving them this attention because the tower here could be you realizing that you just don't want to be invested in such a manner we've got the not a sort of verse bear in mind virgo you could go vice versa okay so you're making them feeling super super frustrated uh super frustrated but the tower is could also be them awakening to the fact that hey i think virgo is serious about cutting me off i think virgo is serious about ignoring me not wanting to talk to me not wanting to do anything with me so yeah, they could be thinking about some plans, strategies to get your attention because they're super frustrated right now. Five of Pentacles in love first, the Hermit in reverse, two cups in reverse. Yeah, most likely both of you are separated or going through some issues right now. Could be a Virgo. Um, this person is thinking about how do they come back in and again get your attention. This is like coming back around energy and the hermit here is in reverse Virgo I think you know what you're doing okay <laughs> I think you know what you're doing and this person is you're making this person feel kind of lost I can't find a solution I can't find uh, I can't do the right thing I don't know what to do to get Virgo's attention uh, or to reconcile if both of you are separated let's see more Virgo three of pentacles and this person could also be somebody who has led you to feel kind of lost at one point in time, okay? 
Queen of Cups in love first. We've got the Three of Pentacles here. This person could be thinking about fixing things with you. Or it could also mean for some of you, this could be somebody who put you in a third party situation, cheating, lying, because the devil could mean that. May not always mean that, yeah? Just take what resonates. They may have learned from their lessons here at the Hierophant. Some of you, this is somebody you're teaching a lesson to. Now, most of my readings are about love, but you can uh, apply this reading to platonic situation, platonic connection, uh, family connection, um, what else? Uh, or romantic connection. The Hierophant is them thinking like, hmm, is Virgo trying to teach me a lesson? Is Virgo trying to, is Virgo lying that Virgo is busy or, you know, whatever Virgo is doing, ignoring me? They could be thinking that you could be lying about it, that you're trying to manipulate them or trying to teach them a lesson because you're not emotionally invested. We've got four queens here, queen of cups and reverse. Now, for some of you, this person could be somebody who put you in so many different third party, fourth party, fifth party situation. Not all of you, okay? Just some of you. Now, we've also got the star here in our first. Yeah, this person wants to heal things with you. They don't know how to do it because you may be Virgo. This is somebody you have been telling yourself, I need to teach this, this person a lesson. I don't want to give in anymore. I don't want to pay attention to them anymore. I've already told them what I had to tell them, and that was it. Most likely, both of you are going through some issues, separation or chaos. But some of you, someone could be jealous of you, and they could be thinking about you in all, all sorts of ways. Um, this could be someone I feel you may have taught them something, okay? And they may be feeling kind of insecure and jealous because there are multiple people here. So you may have mul multiple people thinking about you today, okay? Let's pull out more cards here. I mean, um, this is the truth, truth oracle. Virgo, make sure you subscribe. It's free to subscribe. And also, sometime in mid-October, I'm going to be uh, giving free personal readings during my live stream on this channel. So make sure you don't miss it. Okay, hit on the bell notification button. But you don't know how hard it was to let you go. Maybe there's somebody who has let you go or you may have let this person go. Just being near you is intoxicating. Now, the devil is... They could be thinking about nasty stuff with you, right? Sleeping with you and things like that. So many things remind me of you. So this person thinks a lot about... It could be place, places both of you have been to together. You have, may have eaten the type of food, same type of food together. All of the past experiences. I'm grateful for the spiritual lesson. See, Virgo. You are teaching this person a lesson. Or maybe this person has just learned from their lessons because you stopped giving to them or after a separation. I left you before you could leave me. And we've got finding out the truth crushed me. Maybe there's somebody you have found some truth about the tower here. Whether if it's lying or cheating or the truth that this person is not healthy for you, toxic for you, and you may have cut them off. Or them, you again, it could go vice versa. So I left I left you before you could leave me. So it feels like maybe this is the type of connection where it went the way it ended was very, very abrupt and unexpected. Okay, Virgo, this is your reading. I hope it serves you well. If you don't know, I have a third channel, a Virgo only channel. So on that channel, I do, I give you so many bonus readings over there. So if you're interested, go ahead and subscribe to my third channel. My Virgo only channel is called Virgo by Chelsea. And um, again, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. Give it a like if it resonated in some way, shape or form and comment below. I love Virgo so that you'll be in a running to win a free personal reading with me. Take care, Virgo. I hope to see you back here again soon. I love you. Bye.